one and all do you know why are we meeting today well listen to this poem and find out for yourself i have a special secret whenever i am online i do not share with others the things which are mine my phone my email my home address and my name these facts are for me to know on the website or on the games instead of using my nonsense name i use my net identity People ask me who I am. I say I am Cyber Me. When I search on the web for the cool places, I get the help of my mom, dad, teachers, and the school. Yes, you think it correct. Today we'll talk about the internet. We observe that the 9th February of the year, of every year, we celebrate it as a Cyber Internet Day. But what is this Cyber Internet Day exactly? Now, my friend Arav Sharma will tell you about the Cyber Internet Day. Good morning, respected teachers. I am Arav Nimai Sharma, studying in third B. Today, I am going to tell you about Cyber Internet Day. Cyber Internet Day takes place every February 9 in 2020. Said was celebrated in over 170 countries worldwide. This year, February 11 is being observed as Safe Internet Day. Say, the said initiative first began in Europe but is now recognized in around 150 countries worldwide. Each year, the said aims to increase awareness about online issues such as cyberbullying and choose a topic reflecting current currencies. Now the theme is this year the theme is together for a better internet. Now the question is how you can support the day. First register as a supporter. Second use a campaign toolkit. Third use our education packs. Fourth watch the team. Fifth Sign up for the Safe Internet Day newsletter. In India, the NGO is developing by a developing Internet Safe Community Foundation is the said community. On this is Internet International Safer Day. Information are provided to people through radio about avoiding online fraud in use of ATM and debit card cyber crime. So, to make this day special programs for uh, children and young people about the precautions to be taken during work in internet. Say for internet day, make up. I promise to do one thing too. Stay safe for online. Thank you. You must be thinking. What is there to know about internet? We know everything about internet. Well, my friends, you don't. Today, internet has become a necessity. It's not a platform which we want to use. It's a platform which we have to use. It's a maze and we have to use it wisely. You must know the following points. First, what is internet for? Second, how to stay out of trouble. Third, what to do when you are in trouble. Too much information to look for. But don't worry. My friend from class 5th has made a PPD for the same. Start. everyone. I am Ron Kamra of class 5th C. And I am Rehana Suji of class 5th B. Today we are celebrating Safer Internet Day. So, what do we use internet for? As we know, we use internet for watching TV shows, watching online videos, playing games, talking to friends, etc. etc. But, um, who do you think owns the internet? Who, th who do you think decides what can be put onto in it? Who makes sure the things on the internet are truthful and real? 
answer is no one no one owns the internet no one decides what can put on the internet the internet can be used by everyone and everyone can add things to it but can we trust everyone answer is no if a stranger came up to you in the street talk talked you uh, to ask you and ask to go with them because they had something really good to show you would you go no there might be people who want to help you and people who may want to trick you or be nasty to you but you can't see the people using the internet and it is hard to tell who is nice and who isn't there are uh, uh, people on the internet like the real life some are nice and some are nasty try to follow the points that i am going to tell you first try to use websites that are for children as much as possible second never share your name and address as we don't know the people on internet third if someone cyber bullies you on the internet by sending you nasty messages things and photos we should tell an adult they can help us to report the things and stop bullies fifth we should not write bad things about other people also we can't see them but it will hurt them thank you everyone and have a nice day ahead Sister, move a load. Sister, move a load. Too much information to digest. But don't worry, I have a better solution. My friend from class six will tell you the do's and the don'ts of using the internet. Angel Bola from Class Six Day. Internet safety is the responsibility of everyone. It's not done by someone somewhere. It's done by you, me, and us. Hello, everybody. I am Navan Verma from Class Six Day, and today I'm going to tell you about some things you should not forget before posting anything on social media. And first is, think is it true? Think is it illegal? Hurtful? Think is it legal? Think is it necessary? Think is is it kind? Hello everyone, I am Shohani Verma of Class Six Day. People should feel welcome and free online. Fairly treated, represented, equal, empowered. My name is Ishika Goel of Class Six Day. Educate safe online habits. Limit kids' internet usage. Be the part of child's web affairs. Make them aware of various online threats. A uh, train to click with caution. A uh, use child monitoring apps. I'm Homer Singh from sixth A. Be smart while you're using internet. Don't meet up with strangers. Accept files from known sources only. Keep your personal information private. Thank you. Everyone, my name is Alina Shahar. I study in Class Six C. You should not repeat password or password formula. A strong password is a combination of numbers, letters, and symbols which cannot be hacked. Good morning, everyone. My name is Kush Kapoor. Today, I am going to introduce internet safety. Don't open or download any attachment uh, from unknown sources. I am Vivan Agarwal of Six C. Do not let your web browser remember your username and password, as this could lead to hacking. Good morning, everyone. I am Shivendra Pandey from the Class Six C. I am here telling you that you should never share personal information like a bank account, OTP, and any password to any stranger. It could be dangerous. You know that stranger or he or she could take out all the money from your accounts. Good morning, everyone. My name is Sudarshan from Class Six C. Do not trust WhatsApp news. Read from reputed news websites. WhatsApp news can be fake. Thank you. It was so helpful. 
I hope now you are ready to use the internet safely and properly. Take the help from your parents and teachers and enjoy the journey of the internet. It is rightly said, safe space mean everyone moves easily without fear. Thank you. Have a nice day ahead.